Now, Cho Hyuna, the former vice president of Korean Air, isn't just facing a public backlash for her actions on a recent flight from New York to Seoul. She could potentially also be looking at criminal charges. Cho is expected to appear before investigators this afternoon to answer some tough questions about the so-called net rage incident. Kim Minji reports. Korean Air's now former vice president Cho Hyuna will appear before aviation safety inspectors on Friday afternoon. She initially refused to show but changed her mind after prosecutors raided the headquarters of the nation's flagship carrier over concerns of evidence tampering. Prosecutors have also barred her from leaving the country. Cho will be questioned about whether she used abusive language and why she forced a flight she was on to return to the gate to deplane a crew member. It is important that the airline cooperate sincerely with the investigation, and we ask that passengers who are on board voluntarily appear for questioning. Joe was thrust into the international spotlight about a week ago after making a Korean Air flight from New York to Seoul turn back to the gate when a flight attendant served her nuts in the package instead of on a plate, apparently not following protocol. The government is currently investigating whether her actions broke air traffic safety laws or any regulations. The 40-year-old, the eldest daughter of Korean Air Chairman Cho Yang-ho, first stepped down from her duties related to flight services over the backlash, but later offered her full resignation. Jo will reportedly also quit all her positions at the affiliates of Korean Air, but is expected to maintain the shares she currently holds. Kim Min-ji, Arirang News.